Safety Matters, the state health department confirms Louisiana has 53 cases of the West Nile virus. That's the highest in the country. NBC 6's Delano Henry shares how Cattle Parish is controlling the mosquito population. Delano. That's right, Dan, seven. Seven of those cases are confirmed here in Caddo Parish. Now, I'm here at the Caddo Parish Animal Shelter, and behind it is the Mosquito Control Office, and they say they are working every day to make sure they can control the population. You may see one of these shrubs spraying a fog in your neighborhood. It drifts the and it kills the mosquitoes that are actively flying. During early evenings. The mosquitoes are a little bit more active in the evening. Also, uh, EPA regulations state pretty much we have to spray in the evening because we don't want to kill any beneficial insects. Cattle mosquito control is making sure pests are not growing out of control. We also have a person that goes out and checks for mosquito larvae every day. Um, we also collect mosquitoes and send them in to be tested. During, during the years, we uh, probably get around 1,300 to 1,400 calls throughout the year, depending on uh, certain weather uh, conditions. The Department of Health reported last Friday seven cases of West Nile are in Cattle Parish. Uh, the mosquito that carries West Nile is, is, is nocturnal, and that means it, it's, it's a nighttime flyer. So make sure if you're out at night, if you're out, anything you're doing at night, make sure you wear your uh, repellent. Through millage taxes, the parish is able to spend half a million dollars to control the insects. Until this heat breaks, you know, we'll probably have West Nile around for a while, so, I mean, so people need to be really cautious in the evenings and the early mornings. Now, the health department releases an update every Friday, and we put a link on our website at arclitexhomepage.com. Back to you. Cattle Parish is fighting a good fight. Delano, thank you.